Pat. He's the chief mechanic here at Auto Express. He's been working on cars for more than 20 years and he's going to be assisting us today with our product application. Okay, so Jonathan, we're going to be applying Spaniard Nitro Clean and Spaniard Lubricating Switch Cleaner. 100%. Can you explain to us what you're going to be doing? Yeah, we just come up with an engine fault or MIL light. Um, and what's happened there is the lambda sensor is clogged up and is throwing a fault, not picking up the right oxygen readings. The OBD code comes up. It's the HOS 2 meter control circuit. So what we're going to do, we know it's the upstream circuit. We're going to take that out, give it a clean, and hopefully it will be right. Now we've got switches here which have residue and grease in them being there and there, which then leads to that HOS2 sensor. We're going to clean the insides out with a bit of electric clean and thereafter apply our lubricating switch cleaner to make sure those connections are making proper contact and everything's good there. And at the same time, right at the back down there, we've got a, our oxygen sensor there, which we're going to remove, pull out, and then clean with electric clean. And what's nice to note with the electric clean as well, it's got a, quite a powerful blasting action to get in there and, and get all the guns and rubbish out. Next to lubricating switch cleaner just to make sure we get those terminals nice and clean. Good contact area between the female and male terminals when we do put it all back. What we can also see on the other side of the lambda sensor over there is everything is nice and dry already. Um, so like we said, rapid evaporation leaves no residue behind. So whatever gunge and whatever it's flushed away, it flushes it away and leaves nothing behind. So they're basically no trouble code storing the system. Right, and after our cleaning of the sensor as well, let's see if the engine lights are now gone. No more engine lights. All good.